we're gonna start opening seven each. Most people use tap water to clean their fruits and veggies, so we have some tap water here, and 11.5 alkaline water here. Bring more of the tap water here, and 11.5 water here. If you look at it, you can already see that it's starting to change and remove those pesticides. We're gonna let you soak for two minutes, and then we'll check it out. All right, this is the tap water, we're gonna pour it out. Here is the 11.5 strong pH water. All right, hopefully this one's pretty obvious, but that is not an accurate test for pesticides. So she's basically saying that yellow equals pesticides, but unless you're actually testing that resulting water for pesticides, um, there's no reason to believe that yellow equals pesticides. TikTok seems to be the platform of choice for these people selling multi-thousand dollar water filters for some reason. And this is just another MLM sales pitch. It could be that that highly alkaline water is potentially taking some of those pigment compounds off of the tomatoes, uh, making the water a little bit yellowish in color. Again, you wouldn't know what's actually in it unless you test the water. Rinsing fruits and veggies in clean tap water is sufficient.